All right. It's Coach K's random ass quick tips for the day. Don't know why this is crossing my mind, but obviously somebody needs to hear it. Maybe it's me. I don't know. So we get so much anxiety about making decisions, right? I know that I do. I hate making decisions, you know, as a former like people pleaser, um, always being afraid. Like if I make a decision, it's going to be the wrong one. It's kind of like I always felt that I couldn't hit the reset button. Like if I made the wrong decision, anybody else feel like that? I know I'm not the only one out there. I mean, I hate it. I hate having to make decisions. Um, but I know that it's absolutely necessary, especially if I want to attract what I want in life. Because, like you've heard me say, attraction has the uh, word act and action in it. So you got to do something. So if you feel like you are in a stagnant spot, whether it's with your diet or exercise or work or a relationship or whatever you want to put here, money, if you find yourself like having anxiety over making a decision and acting upon it, okay, and this is what helps me. It's not your final decision. It's just the next decision. You can always hit the reset button. Like nothing is forever. You can always start over again, whether it's with your diet, you know, change things up. I've had a lot of you be like, oh, I want to hit the reset diet. I want to try carnivore or low carb or, you know, I want to try vegan or like whatever diet you want to put there. Cool. Go for it. Try it out. Experiment. Like go on new adventures. Do new shit. Um, it's just your next decision. Like nothing is forever. You can always go back to what you were doing. You can always make another decision. All right. So don't let indecision be your actual decision because it's not going to get you anywhere. It's never going to propel you forward. So I don't know who needed to hear this little angel message. Um, that's basically what I got for you for the day. All right. That's it. Love you guys. I'll chat with y'all today. Peace and love. Bye y'all.